It's day 18 of the Israel-Hamas war. Israel's biggest ally, the United States, is under attack. The latest incident was on Monday. Two drones tried to hit U.S. forces in southern Syria. Both were shot down. It was the fifth such attack in one week. Only minor injuries so far, not even a single death. That does not mean that Washington is, is not worried about what's happening. The U.S. is blaming Iranian proxies for these attacks. But Tehran says, don't blame us. But is anyone talking about peace? Hamas is still holding hostages in Gazan territory, and the U.S. says they must release them first. Only then can a ceasefire be discussed. Doctors say hospital generators will stop working in 48 hours, and if that happens, it will be a disaster. No ventilators, no incubators, not even lights to perform surgeries. In fact, some hospitals are rationing painkillers like morphine. They're operating on patients without them. You can imagine what it's like. 